Hey guys, Graham here, coming at you with another video of Life Story. Now, if you can't tell by the title, this story is called Xanax. <laughs> Let's get right into this. Now, this story takes place last night, whenever I was with a couple of friends. Well, I was with a couple of friends later. Um, but last night I was in a Skype call with a couple of people, and I took the Xanax pills around like 9 o'clock, I guess. I, I, it, was, it was around like 8.30, 9 o'clock whenever I took them. And, uh, so these two girls hit me up and they're like, hey, come to this park. It's like, there's like a park by my house, and they're like, we need you, and I'm like, I'm doing something right now. So, like, I said to them, I'm doing something right now, and the one girl says back to me, whatever, come, like, at 2 a.m., and I'm like, why fucking 2 a.m.? <laughs> How long are you guys gonna be up there? She's like, just come at 2 a.m., and I'm like, okay, whatever. So, I'm in the Skype call for a while longer, and... I left the Skype call around like, uh, I guess like 10 o'clock, maybe. Whenever I left the Skype call, I, I, I basically just went over, watched some YouTube in my bed until 2 o'clock came around. Then I left my house at 2 o'clock, and at this point, I was like, kind of really feeling the effects of the Xanax. And I'm like, I'm going to this park, fucking park at 2 a.m., and yeah, <laughs> I, I, I guess I couldn't really process it, so... So I leave my house, lock the doors and everything, and I go to this park. So I text the girl whenever I'm at the park. I text her, hey, you coming up? And turns out she's fucking asleep. And I'm like, I'm at this fucking park at 2 a.m. By myself, and there's been, like, reported bear sightings. I've actually seen a bear up at this park before. And, which is weird, because this park is, like, kind of a... It's kind of a park in, like, a very, you know, whatever the fucking word is. There's a lot of pedestrians a around my area. And, like, this park is surrounded by houses. Um, so, yeah, it's pretty fucking weird that there's bears and shit up there. So, I go up to this park, and I'm the only one there, like I said. And, uh, so, since she's not coming up and they're sleeping, I just decide to hit up a couple of my other friends. And they come up to this park... And we all decided to walk to this school. And it's like even closer to my house. So we walk to the school. And we're just chilling there for an hour, talking, walking around, smoking shit. So as this is all going on, we walk past a, past a sign that says no trespassing after dusk. And then it's like a $130 fine or something like that. And uh, you can't be up there until like, or can't be up there past nine o'clock or something like that. Um, which I believe is like, no, dawn is whenever the sun comes out, so around like 6 o'clock, I guess. I think it's 9 o'clock on like school days. So, we're up at this park, and usually like security guards will like go around and make sure nobody's up, a up at this like school area. So, we're up there, and we're on this like little playground set that they have at the school, and we see headlights come around this fucking building. And we're all like, we're all like, shit, 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 get down, run. And I'm, I'm on Xanax, so I'm like, I don't know, I'm kind of drowsy, and pills like these don't really, like, make me calm down, even though they're supposed to calm you down. If you don't know what Xanax is, I'm not sure if I explained it at the beginning of the story, I kind of forget. But, um, it's basically to treat anxiety and panic disorders, which I don't have either of them, and they're, it's prescribed, and I'll just say, again, if I haven't said it already... I'm not prescribed Xanax, and, uh, so, yeah, so, I'm just, like, I'm running with them, because there's these headlights, and we all start booking it down the side of the hill, where all these, like, spiky plants and shit are, and I have, like, shorts on, so, if you don't know what these plants are, they're, like, nettles, or something like that, uh, I've, I'm not sure what they're called, but they're, like, fucking these real spiky plants, and all my legs are getting fucking spiked up and I'm like ow oh, fuck fuck so we're all running down the hillside and these headlights come around the like the building and at this point I'm like not even sure if it's security guard or whatever so we all get down on this hillside and at this point we're all like what the fuck are we gonna do there's a fucking police officer up there we can't get arrested 
and uh, so the car just ends up driving by like where we were down on the south side we didn't see if it was like a security guard or anything and it just drives drives by so i assume it wasn't so we all like crawl back up this fucking hillside oh and before i get to that i just wanted to say i woke up and uh whenever i looked at my snapchat i you know saw these pictures on there and i don't remember ever taking them or anything so yeah on with the story and we just like walk around the school a couple more times and then it's around like i'm not sure what time it was at this time i'm not sure what time it was at this time i'm a fucking retard I'm not sure what time it was, like I've just said. <laughs> well, anyway, one last time. I'm not sure what time it was. And they're all like, hey, dude, we're getting tired. We gotta go. And I'm like, you're fucking getting tired? And them leaving me, like, really triggered me for some reason. <laughs> Whatever, man. Keep going. So, they leave, and I'm still up at the school. So, I just decide to... You know, just walk around the school. So there's like two schools in these parking lots. And I just like kind of keep walking around them at like whatever time it was in the morning. I assume it was like either like three or four or something like that. And I just walk around them. And so I, I eventually like get bored of that. And then I remember I like go to walk home. But then I see like this dog walker. Don't ask me why there's a fucking dog walker at three in the morning or whatever whatever time it was i see this dog walker. i go yo man fuck you and your fucking dog dude and i say i say that to him and i'm surprised the person didn't do anything i wasn't sure if it was a dude or a girl because it was dark and i couldn't see and i say that to them and they don't do anything and that's like basically all i remember and um after i do that i like go and I walk down my entire street and I go back to this park and I go up to like these woods area that I can remember unless this was like a dream or something and I go up, like in in a dream or in real life I go up to these woods area and I'm like I look into these woods and I'm like I want to go in there but for some reason I didn't and I just like turned back and I assume I went home because I woke up in my bed and I looked at my clock and it was 7 o'clock whenever I woke up. And yeah, and then I go on my Twitter and my YouTube and shit. And I see this tweet on my Twitter. Fuck this site. And I have no recollection of ever tweeting that or anything. Or like even coming home or opening up my door or anything. I'm not even sure how I opened or how I even got into my house. In consideration that like, you know, I don't remember shit. And I locked the door whenever I left my house. So, yeah. Also, I said how I... Well, I was gonna say how I got the pills. I got them from a friend. and One of the friends that I was with last night. You may or may not know him. Pablo. From a couple of my stories. And, uh, yeah, he he he, he got me them. He g g g got me them. One of my phase adapt. Stuttering. But, yeah, but, but I love... But I love... And I love... <laughs> well, anyway, he got me them. And, uh... Yeah. I just wanted the you know end this story by saying don't do xanax it's it's not all that great most people get like prescribed it for again anxiety shit like that i don't have either panic disorders or anxiety ever but um yeah it's like taking xanax was like a high I, that was like the the weirdest high i've ever had and yeah i just don't really recommend doing it because it is, it can be addictive, and that was the first time I did it, I don't really plan on doing it again, consideration that it wasn't that great, and it was honestly kind of boring, if you ask me, um, besides the me yelling at people's dogs and shit, so, uh, yeah, remember to stay awesome, don't do drugs, and peace out, hope you enjoyed.